Okay, good morning folks. This came through the other day and I had a chance to look at it. Just took it out of the box. You don't want to see an unboxing sort of thing. This is the Promax FT3 Dutch oven. Okay, uh, just very quickly, handy little pamphlet come with it, which is your how to season it. It doesn't need seasoning. It is pre-seasoned, but this is how to re-season it if you have to. How to wash it, how to care for it and all the other bits you can get for it, okay? So that's all in there. It's in different languages, but you'll find French at the back and a bit of English, okay, that's fine. This handy little thing is a recipe book, which I wasn't expecting that. So that's good, we'll look through that. We can have a play with that. Uh, little sticker, I'm a dragon, I quite like that. <laughs> anyway, on that note, let's have a look. I did have a quick peek inside and I bought this one because the one we have already is an 8 litre and it's massive and it well, it's a bit clumsy and it's great and I've left that at the cabin but I wanted something we can take around with us in the van or on the boat or whatever. So we got the lid which acts double up as a frying pan, a skillet, whatever you want to use it for. I did notice a little tiny arrow in the lid. With a lip on it, and I think I know what that's for. Well, I'll look at that in a second. Put him to one side. Let's get him out. All right, okay. A lovely little thing. Really nicely finished. You can see that. And that's what I was looking at. So I reckon this is like a bit of a steam vent. Correct me if I'm wrong. I do not know, but I would say it's like a steam vent. It's great, but there's not, someone says they were rough, but <laughs> I can't see that really. All right. So just the right size for us. Uh, you can get um, a tivet that goes in the bottom of them. Uh, I've already got a handle to pull the lid off and everything. So, so by placing a bit of a cough, placing coals underneath, putting them on there, just put the round to the heat that you need. You can bake bread. Whatever I'm going to have a go in some cinnamon buns, which I bought just to try with this, when this came. What the hell was that? Two seconds, so it's just dropped. Sorry about that. We've got an extension underneath the table, it just fell down. Anyway, so yeah, put your coals underneath, and then you can put your lid back on. Put your coals on, which is the idea of the lip, not letting the coals fall out. Like I said, for the steamer part, I'm pretty sure if you look... Anyway... If you line them two up, you'll see that there's a hole in there. So I reckon that's for steaming or letting any heavy pressure out. Like I said, you put your coals on top, which will let you do your baking for your bread or your cinnamon buns, which I'm going to try today with a bit of luck. Um, like really good strong handle. I'm quite chuffed with that one because the other ones are quite thin, really sturdy. I'm really looking forward to have a go with this. Really well made. Yeah. So if you'd like to see me using this, like and subscribe, that would be great because they'll be coming up with the next up and coming videos, hopefully one today with a bit of luck with those cinnamon buns, but we will see. Yeah, it's a, like I said, FT3, so it serves one to three people, um, three litres, I believe. You can get, I think that I mentioned that, you can get tivets for going inside. Uh, I've already got a handle which hooks underneath here and you can take that off. It's got a spring on the end of it so it keeps it nice and cool. The spring on the handle, I mean. So yeah, if you enjoyed the vid, please give it a thumbs up and a like. And we will catch you in the next video or probably in this video, not this particular one, but cooking those cinnamon buns, which I'm really looking forward to. All the best, take care. Sorry folks, very quick correction. The FT3 does not mean three litres. It's that's why I, I remember getting it now. I wanted less than three litres because it's quite a lot. This is actually 1.6 litres, okay? And the lid is 0 0.4 of a litre. So if that's right, that'd be like two litres combined, but it's not. It's only 1.6 litres internal, and then you've got the lid as well on top. Okay, so I apologise for that. Bit of a mistake on my half. I thought, well, that's lot three liters then i realized that it wasn't it was 1.6 liters okay so uh sorry about that and uh, we'll definitely catch you in the next one